Okay, so I thought I'd do a, just a quick uh, a description of the uh, shrinker stretcher stand I made. It's a uh, foot operated one. Uh, works quite well for me. I just made it out of scrap around the shop. Uh, I'm going to upload the plans to uh, Metal Meat and I'll include the link in the uh, description below. But uh, I'll show it to you right now just to give you some idea of what it looks like as a whole unit. Okay, here it is. You'll have to ignore the mess. This is the upstairs of my shop, which is basically just storage for any number of a thousand different things. Studebaker fenders, three different grills. Uh, so this is the unit. It's literally, it's it's nothing. There's no dimension. I don't think that's critical at all here. Uh, just an H base. Uh, that's the, uh, the uh, foot pedal. This is just a, uh, I think it's a screen door spring. Um, right down here, that piece right there is the, uh, is, I think it's a turnbuckle that I cut in half and used at the top and the bottom with a piece of uh, all thread to connect it. There's no reason why you couldn't just use a welded piece for the whole length of it. I don't think there's any real need for it to be adjustable. Um, right there is a piece of angle that I uh, cut to use as a stop. Um, this is just a piece of one by one with uh, some 3 16th plate and a little bit of uh, expanded metal. Um, you know, it's actually, it's really, really simple. Just some one by three that I used there for the, uh, for the support for the pivot for either side. It, you know, each side is just a mirror image of the other one. Um, so there's not really any point in showing anything different. It's actually really, really simple. Um, just to use some more 1x3 uh, for, uh, for uh, mounts for this. You might want to use something a little bit stronger, but I haven't had it actually bend on me. Um, really, that's, that's about it. You know, like it's, it's not especially clever, but it's, uh, but it's simple. So there you go.